Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I thought I'd share with you some of my holiday essentials, things that I am using and doing and loving um, to get myself into the holiday spirit here in Florida. I will tell you that this weekend we had our first truly sweater weather weekend where I was so excited and my husband and I took a drive through this neighborhood near where we live called Abacoa in Jupiter, Florida. That is absolutely lovely. It's this beautiful sort of tree-lined, neighborhood where there's a lot of shade and um, less palm trees and things that look like Florida. It actually reminds me a lot of um, like Charleston, South Carolina and that kind of thing. Um, but it's really beautiful there and so we took a drive through and the leaves had actually changed and had fallen all over the street. They were not bright colors but you know mostly shades of brown but the fact that there were leaves down and you know it looked like fall I was very happy. So um, yeah I'm finally getting into to some cozy sweaters. I know the weather will not stay like this forever, but um, it is feeling a little bit more like the holidays are coming anyway. So I'm sure that it'll come as no surprise that my first uh, holiday essential would be fragrance and not just the fragrance I wear, but also the fragrance I surround myself with in my home. I feel like fragrance has such an effect on my mood and um, definitely has a lasting impact on how I feel throughout the day. So I think that um, surrounding myself with kind of comforting holiday scents that get me into the holiday spirit is definitely something I um, do every year and have not stopped doing. So the fragrance I'm wearing today and I am absolutely dying to just go Christmas shopping, just smelling it, <laughs> is Hypnotic Poison by Dior. And you can actually kind of see into the bottle that I've made quite a dent on this one. This is a, um, Kind of vanilla almond sweet but warm and comforting just beautiful scent that i love to wear during the holiday season especially when i'm doing some christmas shopping um, and when i'm decorating and wrapping gifts and all that kind of stuff i just like to have this type of fragrance where it kind of puts me in the in the mood but it is an eau de toilette so it's not super strong um, but it does have some staying power and it's just a beautiful beautiful fragrance that's still light enough to wear when the weather is a little bit warmer um, and i will tell you that we are actually making progress on our townhome um, or the builders are making progress it is anticipated to be ready by end of year, early next year, still on schedule. So we are really excited about um, getting in there and we probably won't be decorating here. So I am um, probably moving right around the holiday time. So definitely surrounding myself with fragrance is one of the ways that I will be kind of getting into that festive spirit this year. And going along with fragrance, another thing I love to do during the holidays is light candles. I feel like having candles lit and having cozy, comforting smells that remind me of the holidays are always a great way to go. And the one that I have been using the most this year has been Wood Sage and Sea Salt by Jo Malone. This is such a warm, woody, delicious fragrance that always makes me think of the holidays. I light this and my home just smells amazingly like the holidays. So really, really loving um, my wood, sage, and sea salt candle from Jo Malone. And my last way that I like to sort of surround myself with fragrance during the holidays is doing a little extra pampering, using some extra beauty products and skincare products and things that sort of surround me with sort of that comfy, cozy feel. And vanilla is one of my favorite scents for the holiday season. So a couple products that I've been loving uh, from Philosophy, the first is their French Vanilla Bean. This is a shampoo slash body wash slash, I think they say you can use it as yeah, a bubble bath product. Um, I have not been doing that yet, but I have been using it as a shampoo and also um, as my body wash, and it is just amazing. Um, so really loving that. And then I also love to put on all kinds of lotions and potions during this time of year, but one of the ones that I really love for the holiday season is the Fresh Cream Warm Cashmere, also from Philosophy. This, um, if you're familiar with the Fresh Cream fragrances, this has um, a little bit more warmth and a little bit of that sort of cashmere note in it that makes it really warm and comforting and cozy. And it's not overpowering. You can layer it with a lot of different fragrances. I have it on today with, um, again, the Dior um, Hypnotic Poison, and I feel like they layer really well. So have really been loving that. 
My next holiday essential would be coziness and comfort and luxurious fabrics. Everything that gives me all of the sort of holiday feels and um, just makes me warm and comforted. And so a few of the things that I love to do, um, number one, wearing sweaters like the one I'm wearing today. This is from Everlane and it is just um, their alpaca cardigan and I love these and I was so afraid I wasn't going to be able to wear them and I'm so happy that the weather dropped enough to be able to wear them. So um, these are definitely a big favorite during the holiday season, super cozy and comforting. Um, I also really love to wear cashmere during the holidays. I've got a few of Everlane's cashmere sweaters that I'm really happy to be able to wear again um, throughout the holiday season. And then the latest um, thing that I have been really loving this year that I think will be definitely big for the holiday season is um, silk. So I love silk. This is a new dress that I actually um, got from Quince. And um, it's really just this beautiful midi length slip dress and it's gorgeous to kind of layer something over. I apologize, it is a little wrinkled um, from how it was folded, but yeah, I need to steam this. But it's absolutely beautiful, something I know I'm gonna wear for the holidays and be able to just kind of throw on, you know, a little sweater over top and it'll just be warm and luxurious and comforting all together and um, that is kind of like my favorite way to dress during the holiday season. My third holiday essential would definitely be a red lip. I love to wear red lipstick around the holidays. It's probably the only time of year that I wear so much red lipstick, um, but I am wearing today my favorite shade for the holidays. This is from Chanel. This is their Rouge Allure. I have my glasses here because I knew I wasn't going to be able to read this. It's the Rouge Allure Velvet um, and I think it's in the shade just number five. I picked this up a few years ago and it is this gorgeous kind of, for me, true red. It's a little bit of a blue red. I actually put a little bit on my cheeks as blush today, so um, it definitely goes a little pink, but it is a beautiful color for the holiday season. Um, and I know that Chanel just came out with um, a holiday set of um, five lipsticks part of their like number five holiday collection and um they all have like the chanel number five um logo i think on the top and i think most of the shades are red so i'm definitely going to be picking one of those up um this year for the holiday season but definitely loving um this one from a few years ago and then i have a couple other shades of red that i wanted to share because i know people will ask um a few of them are from Charlotte, Til oh no, one of them is from Charlotte Tilbury, sorry. This is Red Carpet, and this is a gorgeous, um, again, kind of cool tone red that I love wearing during the holiday season. And all of these are kind of matte, not super matte, but um, definitely matte formulas. And then I have two um, from Lisa Eldridge. This one is Velvet Ribbon, which, oh my God, this is such a gorgeous red. This is the most perfect. In fact, I should have probably put this on today just to try something a little different since I wear this like every year during the holidays. But this is a gorgeous, gorgeous shade of red for the holidays. And then I also have um, Velvet Jazz from Lisa Eldridge. And this is a deeper red, which I would definitely enjoy wearing um, during the holiday season in the evenings when I'm going out somewhere a little more formal. If we do something for New Year's, something like that, um, that would be a beautiful color for that as well. My fourth holiday essential would be to add a little sparkle. I love sparkle during the holidays and I'm not someone who normally wears a lot of jewelry, but during the holidays all of my sparkly things come out. I've got quite a bit of costume jewelry, um, mostly bracelets that I have that are very sparkly and pretty and I love to kind of layer those up during the holidays. I also picked up this year and still have yet to wear um, a couple pairs of shoes from Zara that were so, so cute um, that just have these little crystals on them. I have them in black as well as in nude because I'm crazy like that. I can't just buy one of them. They were such a good price and something that I think I will have for a long time. So um, yeah, these are really super cute. And then I also have this vintage ring that belonged to my grandmother that I always pull out. It's I use it as a little cocktail ring. Um, it's the beautiful kind of diamond and pearl ring that definitely always comes out during the holidays.
My last holiday essential would have to be accessories. I have quite a lot of accessories, as you all know, including handbags and scarves and things, luxury items that I don't use often enough and I love to use them and appreciate them during the holiday season. So one of those would be my Burberry scarf. This is my um, silk and cashmere one that I absolutely love and will definitely be getting some use this holiday season. Um, and then the other is my Chanel bag, um, my classic flap. This is my favorite of all my handbags and for some reason I don't use her as much as I should. So during the holidays I'm going to make an effort to be using this beautiful bag because she works with everything. She's the perfect size for day, night, whatever. Um, and she just needs a little more love. So I feel like the holidays are the time to like use what you have and appreciate what you have and um, just surround yourself with things that bring you joy and comfort. And for me, um, all of the things I've talked about here today, that is kind of what they are to me. They just put me in the holiday spirit because they bring me joy and comfort. And um, spending time obviously with my loved ones will be the other way I love to spend my holiday season. Um, and I'm really looking forward to being closer to a lot of those people this year. So anyway, those are my holiday essentials. I would love to know what some of yours are. So please leave that in the comments below. And um, I will be doing up next a holiday fragrance video, my top 10 holiday fragrances, since I have so many that I love. I only included one in this video, but there are so, so many that I love to wear during the holiday season. And um, um, yeah, I'm finally getting in the holiday spirit. It really kind of feels even that little bit of a drop in temperature here felt great this weekend. And I'm looking forward to um, spending more time outdoors now that it is not so um, crazy hot and humid. So anyway, thank you all for watching and I will see you soon in my next video. And I wish you all a happy and healthy holiday season ahead. And um, we'll talk to you soon. Bye.